Hello, everybody. This is your friendly neighborhood of good. And today, we are going to start over. Okay. So, the last time that thing didn't work very well, how I did it, and um, couldn't figure out how to import it uh, when, we're, when I was... Uh, when I finished up that last uh, video, um, I was I was looking at the the download page and it still said download. It didn't say install. And when, then when I looked at some reviews for the uh, for that particular you know little adventure game package, it says uh, um, it doesn't work right with the newest version. And uh, one person said that they went back to an older version and installed the older version, and then uh, it worked fine. But then when I looked at uh, another thing called 3D Beginner, it's John Lemon's Haunted Jaunt or something, um, and uh, I, I did the first few things that it said to do, which it said to kind of do pretty much the same thing that um, I was trying to do with the other one, which is basically you go in, you create a project, um, you um, then you go to the asset store, then you search for the particular uh, asset, um, download it, and then it has an import button. And actually, the other one had an import button too when I went into my assets. But uh, in any case, um, I basically decided that uh, if if I could uh, actually go through that here, and since this is going to uh, teach me how to do a Unity project from scratch, and it looks like it's not using videos. It might use videos later on. I don't know because I only got through one part of it. But um, so I'm looking at it and kind of going, this is would have been more ideal anyways um so we're gonna kind of restart we're gonna reset and we're gonna um we're gonna do this over again um with this this other project now i deleted everything so i should be back starting from scratch so to speak so now what i need to do is i need to go to okay that's not that um I was trying to figure out how to remove assets. Supposedly they had a delete button before, but now they don't. Now you actually have to go into the stupid folders and like, um, okay, that's the Unity project folder. That's different, but um, going to roaming and this hidden and all this junk and whatever, but whatever, whatever, I, I, uh, I, uh, I delete it. We're restarting and this is actually the tutorial we're going through. Uh, here, let's actually let's just go back right from the beginning. John Lemon, Tana John, 3D beginner. Um, five hours and thirty minutes supposedly to total, and really that's kind of all I need to um, essentially um, start on my um, to learn how to do a demo. So five hours isn't very much. Um, it's actually, it's going to be six or seven days worth of videos. Um, so I might, uh, go through one part of it and then switch back to the Blender Noob to Pro, um, so that I can kind of keep going without actually, you know, doing like, you know, the, the thing that I wanted to avoid before was, uh, was, uh, sticking to one thing, right? So like spending forever, like learning Blender, right? If I spent the, my whole time learning Blender, um, you'd be wondering where you know where's the game? Where, I thought you were making a game. I didn't think you were learning Blender. Um, even though learning Blender is part of me making the game and I'm documenting it, um, it would be just like too long and people might get bored. Um, obviously, you get bored anyways because I'm speaking, <laughs> but. Um, you might be going, I, I, you know, I've been watching this for a long time now, and you're not actually getting to make it in game. So, um, and part of the deal of, of uh, lo uh, documenting my game making experience and um, uh, is uh, going through. Well, it the part of the deal is I wanted to learn these different aspects. I want to learn animation, coding. Um, I mean, I I know pretty much a lot of that stuff already um in general um you know but uh i'm not really that good in everything everything so um i wanted just to go learn the different aspects and so it combines all into this one project and this works um so 
what instead of uh, spending all my time until I get done with the with the book, the wiki book, and then going on the next thing, I'm hoping to actually make some progress on the game itself. So to do that, I'm gonna have to go through this, and so I might not go through the whole thing um, um, contiguously. So uh, I might like go through like a part or a couple of parts, and um, then switch back to so it might be a couple of days of this and then switch back to the wiki book and then switch back to this and so on and so forth so that's uh that's uh where we're standing right now okay so uh welcome to john lemon's haunted john 3d beginner project in this project you won't just discover how to create a stealth game each of the 10 tutorials also explains the principles behind every step no previous experience is necessary is needed which makes john lemon's haunted john the perfect start to your journey with unity which is just what I need. In fact, after doing this, um, I everything else I should be able to pretty much do myself. You know, I mean, I should be able to learn stuff and that I don't actually have to go through tutorials, even if I do end up going through a tutorial later because I want to. Okay, so objective, gain confidence using the Unity Editor, explore the car concepts of game development in Unity, create your own self game from the game object to final build, write a custom code to enhance your game, consider and improve the player experience throughout. Uh, you've completed 0% of this project, setting up 3D beginner, player character, part one, player character, part two, the environment, the camera, the end of the game, enemies, part one, enemies, part two, audio, build, run, distribute. Okay, so this is where I start, and this is where I begin, right here. And, uh, there we go. Okay, so, in this first tutorial, you'll set up the Unity Editor, create a project for your game, explore the Unity Editor. When you finish, you'll be ready to jump right into creating your own game. And then, um, this is, uh, one is setting up the Unity Editor, two, creating a project, three, importing the assets, four, Unity Editor interface, toolbar, and navigation UI, and layouts. Perfect. In fact, uh, I might just do this one, maybe. It depends. Um, if, if I can finish it within these uh, today's four videos, um, we'll see. Um, or I may do another day of this tutorial. Um, it, we'll just see how far we get, I guess. Um, I'll, I'll find a stopping point, and then uh, I'll switch back to the to the wiki book for blender okay so setting up the unity editor welcome to john lemon's haunted john 3d beginner project in this project you won't just discover how to create the game the game each of the 10 tutorials also explains the principles behind every step no previous experience is needed which makes john lemon's haunted john the perfect start to your journey with the unity which i just read in this first tutorial you will explore the unity editor and get ready to begin making your own self game uh, before you can create uh, a new project, you'll need to have 2019.1 version of the Unity Editor installed, which I do. To do this, install the Unity Hub by visiting Download Unity Personal on the Unity website. For advice on using Unity Hub, see Unity Hub documentation. Please note the following steps have been written for you to download this project carefully using the instruction below. If you already downloaded John Lemon's Honda Jaunt via the Hub's Learn tab, you'll need to set your preferred Unity Editor to 2019.1. Okay, so I'm just going to click this real quick, and that, um, if you don't know, that's just uh, Bravery Rewards, so I'm getting uh, basic attention tokens, which is their own um, tokens based on Ethereum, and uh, supposedly I can make money with it, and um, I, I had made a little bit, you might say, by clicking on these ads, but uh, I'm digressing again. Okay, so I'm going to mark this step is com as completed as far as downloading uh, Unity. Uh, download, okay. Mark this as completed. And now let's go to creating a project. Open Unity Hub. Log in with your Unity account. Click New button at the top right corner. And I'm just going to kind of stay um, logged in, I guess, and uh, we'll see here. Okay, so what do I need to do? Uh, let's see. Uh, project name, call it 3D Beginner. Set the version. Choose the folder where you want to save your project. Uh, make sure your template is 3D. Create project. Okay, so we'll do that now. 
and of course mine is 21.9.1.7 okay 3d project let's call this 3d beginner and you can see I already created a folder in my dev stuff uh, folder on my D drive which is a, a an actual regular hard drive it's not the it's not the SSD which is um, what my my C drives on but uh, it's fine um, okay so now it's creating it and we'll wait for a second till it, you know everything pops up and everything is going and then probably it'll probably be just about time to to um, quit and go to the next video so we didn't do that much in here but that's okay um, we will see we will see okay so connecting the asset store I don't need to log in because uh, I'm not logging out um, Normally, I try to log into everything so that I remember my passwords so I don't have to write them down. But uh, in some cases, I, I tend to do it anyways. And uh, so there's that. Okay, so now that, now that we got into Unity and everything, uh, you know, I mean, you saw before that I, um, that I downloaded Unity. And, of course, it's running right now. So all we did is just create a project. And so uh, in the next uh, video, we will go on to the next step, which is probably downloading his uh, or downloading the, the project. So uh, stay tuned.